everybody, welcome back to Samsung in a Minute, the channel that trains you on your Samsung Galaxy devices, one topic or one feature at a time in a consumable fashion. So today we'll talk about Samsung One UI 7.0, the expanded folders. So when it comes down to the expanded folders, it's actually much easier to use than if you just use the regular folders. So down over here, you can see that these are the regular size folders. Yes, I like to use a lot of folders for organization. You can see everything is all titled. Here's all of my tools. Also, here is everything for YouTube. So pretty much what happens is if I want to go inside of you know YouTube itself, I have to open this up and then tap on the application. But when it comes down to anything that is expanded, you can just simply tap on it and then it opens up. So for any of these that you would like to use, you just tap it, open it up, boom, and it's just there. It's all organized. And if there is more that you would also like to view, you tap on these three little dots and then you can actually view everything. So pretty much just remember that when it comes down to your first eight applications, the ones that you would want to see all the time, make sure those are the first eight applications in this expanded folder that you can see right there. So how do you get the expanded folder? Pretty much all you would have to do is you would want to move this thing over where there would be room for it to get bigger. What you'll do is you'll press and hold and then hit on enlarge. So pretty much this is just one of those really nice ways that you're able to kind of, you know, create different types of spaces with your device. You can put applications in between the folder. So I can actually just move this one over here, press and hold, enlarge it. You can move them all around, do whatever you want to. So you can just place things in the middle. You can put other widgets. So I can actually put like another widget down over here. So instead of this one sitting up over there, I can maybe bring this one over here. I can even expand it. You know, if it was one of those other uh, widgets that can go a little bit larger, if it looked better, you know, that way. So pretty much there's just so many things that you're able to do when it comes down over into your, your home screens, when it comes down to Samsung One UI 7.0. So this is my main one. I just pretty much have, you know, a widget up here, a couple more widgets, and then I have the expanded folders. Oh, and another thing that I want to show you is that if you're somebody who loves to use your phone in landscape mode, so it doesn't matter, you know, if you're already in an application and you go back to the home screen or you just rotate the device, Samsung's uh, One UI 7.0 works really well and pretty much flawlessly and rearranges everything to make it look so much better than what it did in Samsung One UI 6. So I have, you know, some of my regular square looking applications and folders here. All of my widgets are right there. My expanded stuff is up there. So they don't make everything look all, you know, ugly and disorientated. Pretty much in Samsung One UI 6, if you did this, it wouldn't really look that good. And here you can just see how it puts it right back into place where everything was already originally. They were just able to make it look so much better when it comes down to the landscape mode. So I am a huge fan of the enlarged folder just because if I ever want to just get into something super quick, I'd be able to just tap on it. It goes right on inside of there. Uh, and it just makes it so much easier to use while keeping everything so organized. If you ever need to get into it, you still can just by hitting those three little dots. But yeah, this is what it was from beforehand. I'd have to tap it and then tap it again to actually get inside. With this one, you just simply tap on whatever you want to get in. And that's pretty much it. So I was able to teach you and show you how you're able to enlarge them. And then this is pretty much how you're able to shrink them back up. You just press and hold, tap the little shrink button, and now everything just goes right back into the normal state. So hopefully you guys have appreciated this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left-hand side. And if you like this video, the more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later.